Okay, this is Larry Yeager at Yeager Cycle, and um, uh, I got a maybe a little bit of a seat improvement for the stock seat for you guys uh, and gals. I've seen it on Facebook myself. I noticed a lot of people's doing this, so I tried it, and actually it did seem to make a difference for me. So um, if, if, if you're like me, you found that the stock seat, when you're just cruising down the road, sitting down, uh, it, you seem to migrate to the gas tank. It's just kind of where you end up being. Uh, which ends up being kind of uncomfortable after a little while. So, um, uh, and you can push yourself back. It's what I find myself doing, but then I end up going right back to that same position. Um, I did a tall boy seat and that helped. Uh, this tall boy seat seems to be a, a Harley Davidson tall boy seat seems to be a little bit flatter and a little bit better and it did, it did help some. But when I'm riding off road and I want to do a, like a quick elephant turn, I want to do something kind of quick, it's so tall it's a little bit hard to lean the motorcycle over and, and to make those maneuvers. So anyway, um, what I found uh, in doing some research, so, uh, people are taking the stock seat off, the stock front seat. Make sure when you take that thing off, you're careful here where you pull it out from this, these side brackets. Boy, I'm always afraid it's gonna tear my seat. So I got a stock one here and I've got a modified one and I'll show you the difference. So this is a stock seat, and you can see these posts right here that rest on the frame uh, extend up. I shortened them on this one about a quarter of an inch. Um, and basically, I just took a little die cutter, cut a quarter of an inch off each post. Um, and what that does is those posts rest right on this frame member right here on both sides. So basically, what it's doing is it's pitching the back of the seat down further, flatter, uh, to where it's it's not so high in the back and low in the front and uh, I definitely noticed a difference it's a simple easy improvement um, about, like I say about a quarter of an inch is about all you want to cut off you don't want to get down into the main part of the base but anyway that's just a little tip that you might try and, and see if it helps you with your stock seat. thank you so hey I learned something I had a viewer point out that I had made an incorrect statement about uh, when you trim the knobs off the bottom of the seat of it lowering the seat and they were correct I, I appreciate them pointing that out to me and I had misspoke in the video uh, What actually happens when you trim these posts off like this you take a quarter inch off of them It lowers the back of the seat, but it only works in the high position it does nothing in the low position So hope that helps you